This week is National Consumer Protection Week. The Michigan Bankers Association is working with the so-called Banks Never Ask That campaign to educate people on phishing scams. News 10's Azal Herschel has some advice to keep you safe from these scammers. Phone calls and emails from scammers are becoming more common. Fishers are pretending to be banks and companies to scam innocent people out of thousands of dollars. People constantly get text messages with these links that aren't really the company. Better Business Bureau employee Nakia Mills says phishing scams are getting extremely popular. Even us at the BBB, people will act as imposters to try to scam people pretending they are us. So even the Better Business Bureau, <laughs> we're not immune to this. Mills says some red flags to look for in emails and phone calls are misspellings of common words, bad grammar, generic greetings such as dear member, suspicious links, and urgent messages saying action is required immediately. It's all just an attempt to get your personal information so that they can just do more damage and hopefully get some money from your bank account. There's an emotional impact where people can be embarrassed that someone was able to take advantage of them. These scams can be anything from an email asking for money to being told you won the lottery. Lee Ammerman from the MSU Federal Credit Union says she sees these scams happen to her clients daily. Thieves are only getting more clever with the use of AI technology in their corner. Attorney General Dana Nessel says to be on the lookout for strange calls. If it's your your you know friend or neighbor calling and they're asking you questions about your social security number or they're asking you questions about your bank account, um, that should send up a red flag for you pretty quickly. The best thing to do if you think you're a victim is to contact your financial institution. In East Lansing, Isley Herschel, News 10. All right, Isley, thank you. The Better Business Bureau is partnering with Blue Cross Blue Shield to educate people on these types of scams. They will be putting on presentations from now until April to help people spot the red flags and protect their personal information.